Bernie Madoff has always said that he carried out that $65 billion Ponzi scheme alone. More and more, though, the evidence suggests otherwise. Drawing on court papers filed in the year and a half since Madoff was arrested, the journalism website ProPublica makes the case that his scheme was a conspiracy involving at least a half dozen men. The papers show members of this inner circle did far better than other investors, and on more than one occasion, they helped keep the scam alive by funneling hundreds of millions of dollars to Madoff. Among those investors, Maurice Cohn's Comad Securities raked in over 90 Eight million dollars in fees from 1996 to 2008. Robert Jaffe also at Comad, funneling over one billion dollars in investor money to Madoff. Carl Shapiro bailed out Madoff in 2008, giving him 250 million dollars when investors demanded their money back. Stanley Chase, Madoff Investments consistently received yearly returns greater than 100 percent. And Jeffrey Peckauer made 7.2 billion dollars in profit from the scheme. None of these investors has been charged with a crime. I'm still, court trustee Irving Picard has sued several of them, saying that they, quote, knew or willfully ignored that they were participating in a fraud.